today we know many reasons why we can suffer from alopecia however one of the most common causes is usually attributed to dihydrotestosterone dst and its effects on our hair therefore today we will explain what dst is and how to combat it DHT also known as dihydrotestosterone is a sex hormone derived from testosterone responsible for stimulating masculine characteristics. But what happens if the hormones gets out of control and produces more than necessary? In that case, we would be facing a case of androgenetic alopecia, thus it is crucial to act as soon as possible. Contrary to what many people think, DST can be found in both men and women. Although men having a greater amount of testosterone are more prone to suffer from this type of alopecia. Now why does DST occur? Well, it occurs due to a case effects relationship specifically a change that triggers alopecia this chemical reaction takes place in the scalp and the enzymes 5 alpha reductase plays a major role this enzyme is responsible for converting testosterone into dihydrotestosterone which then binds to the receptors of the hair follicles so how does this affects our hair the truth is, it reduces its normal life cycle, promotes miniaturization, decreases its caliber and quality, ultimately leading to the atrophy of the follicle. Now how can you know if you are suffering from DHT? In reality, there are certain symptoms that we may all experience, which could indicate this type of condition. These symptoms usually include excessive sweating, the appearance of acne, the presence of facial and body hair growth or hair loss in certain areas of the scalp. Additionally, an increase in blood pressure or the development of sleep apnea along with episodes of aggression may also occur. However, it's important to note that you don't need to experience all of these symptoms to suffer from DHT-related alopecia. Nonetheless, it's crucial to pay attention to both your body and scalp as the presence of any of these signs could indicate badness. Now, let's say you are indeed suffering from alopecia caused by DHT, how can you stop it? The most recommended approach is to take certain medications that help combat hair loss. Among these options are finasteride or dutasteride which work by inhibiting the enzyme 5 alpha reductase to slow down the progression of baldness. Another option is minoxidil which promotes hair growth and is highly recommended. I advise you to visit your doctor and undergo an examination to determine the most suitable prescription medication for your condition. Not all drugs have the same potency or work in the same way. However, if you prefer to avoid medication, there are other products and methods available such as shampoos containing ketoconazole which prevents the conversion of testosterone into DHT. These shampoos are generally safe for long-term use. Another option is azelaic acid which inhibits the activity of 5-alpha reductases. If you are not convinced by these options, there are natural alternatives like pumpkin seed which acts as a natural DHT blocker. So palmetto is another natural option that can help as well as the use of caffeine which we have discussed in previous videos and has been shown to reduce hair loss. If you suspect you are suffering from DHT related alopecia, don't wait until it's too late. In today's video, don't forget that you can support the channel by leaving a like, subscribing and sharing the video on various social networks. Additionally, we would love to hear your thoughts on the video, so please leave your comments in the comments box below. If you haven't already checked out our official MyCapi blog, where you can find all the information you need to know about the world of hair. Moreover, if you are currently undergoing a hair evolution process and would like to share your journey with us through photos, you can do so by sending an email to the address provided in the information box or description below. In a future video, we will analyze the different cases that have been sent to us. Thank you for watching and a bid farewell here. See you in the next video. Best regards and take care.